Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to do a review on this Ninja Frost Vault Cooler. This is the 50 quart version. It's a color white. We're going to go over all of it. I've also done some testing to see how long the ice lasts. The ice lasts a really long time. But what's really neat about this is the dry zone. So right here, this is going to keep stuff cold but dry. And up here is where you put everything, all the ice and the sodas and everything you want to keep on ice but we can keep our dry stuff down here and keep it cold. So let's do some dimensions real quick. Okay, so here's a close up look of the dry zone. It's got two compartments, but you slide this in and that locks it. We've got this big hinge, we can lock it. We've got two great big handles and we can also strap it down if we need to. Here's what the inside looks like. Okay, so we're gonna add some stuff, some sodas and different things, but first, 21 and three quarters, front to back, whoop. Yeah, be careful, that lid does not wanna stay up sometimes. Okay, whoops. All right, one more time. Front to back, 11 and a half inches depth. Oh, nine and a half inches. It does say to use 25 pounds of ice and it does have a drain down there. So here's the drain. I like that it's got a lanyard on it. Now, what I love about this is, is it's flat. It's not angled. Um, the water does drain out, but it's relatively all flat. So we can stack sodas on top of each other. Here's bottled water. Again, all kinds of room in here. So you can imagine we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight going across and one, two, three, four going that way. And again, we can stack these on top of each other and it still closes. And again, there's the drain. Okay, so up on the lid, we got a really nice seal. Again, pretty thick. Let's go down here. You know, we can put sandwiches in here, fruit, vegetables. It does keep it cold for the testing I did on the smaller version, the dry zone, it stayed under 40 degrees for about seven days. That was with a great big full bag of ice up here and it always stayed dry. So you can put all kinds of stuff down here. You can even take this out and there is, I think it's dust proof because there is a little seal there. When you do put it in, Okay, let's do dimensions of these drawers. Each drawer is eight and a half inches by about 11, almost 10 and three quarters. Height wise, you can go a little bit taller, about three and a half inches because you still have a little bit more room up there. Let's go over the drain plug here. I love that they have this lanyard. Now, is that the size of a hose fitting? No, I don't think that is. I think it's a, that's its own threads but it does have a seal and it's easy to put on and you're not gonna lose it because it's attached with a lanyard. Okay, so the unit weighs 29 pounds with nothing in it. You know, it's, it's nice that it has two handles that you might need two people. Let's, here's what the bottom looks like. It's got these big rubber grippy pads. Let's go, let's do some overall measurements. All right, with handle to handle, 33 inches. To the top of the lid, 19 inches. Front to back, with the hinge, 17 inches. Now let's open it up. Let's see how much you need with it opened up. Wow, and again, be careful, this thing. All right, let's get this. With the lid all the way open, 33 inches, 33 inches with the lid all the way open. Okay, so my very next video is gonna be, Ninja did give me this blue one for free. I bought this one with my own money. This one costs $250, the big one. This one's $200. I did a bunch of testing on this. Up to eight days, it kept the ice cold. It kept inside cold and the bottom. So this thing, I have no doubt that it's gonna work just the same as that. So I'm gonna do a comparison. Again, I bought this white one with my own money. $250, would I spend 250 If I needed this big of a cooler, I love the dry zone. It works. I've seen it work on this. I've done eight days of testing and, and putting a temperature probe down there. It just works. Now these things are kind of big. I think they're gonna come out, come out with some on wheels, 
this, you know, both of these actually do need wheels. They're pretty heavy. So links in the description. Um, be sure and check out my very next video. Look for me on Instagram over there, just to add videos. I do lots of vacuum cleaner reviews, Ninja products, Shark, vacuum cleaners. Pretty excited about what's going on. So if you could hit the thumbs up button and the subscribe and thanks for watching.